got uh, Jean Rodriguez. Yes. And we've got Sandy Hawkins from the Rosemary Goddard Centre in Mia. Uh, Jean, tell us about the centre. What do you do? Well, actually, Sandy is the organiser, so she'll probably explain Sandy, a bit Sandy, what more. do you do? <laughs> <laughs> um, well, the Rosemary Goddard Centre is a registered charity that was established back in 1988. Um, and we meet twice a week um, and provide a place for older people who are socially isolated or lonely. They can come and enjoy a hot meal, um, take part in some activities and basically enjoy each other's company. Just for Mere or from surrounding villages as well? It's the surrounding villages as well, yeah. It's so, Mere and districts. Okay. Uh, how long has it been going for? Since 1988. 88? Yeah. So I sort of work out the maths there. Uh, 20 odd. 25, yeah. 20 odd years? Yeah. yeah yes, about 24 yeah. years. Yeah. And how long have you been both both involved with the centre for Well, now? I think I've been about 10 years as a volunteer. Mm hmm. And, and I'm a newbie. I, uh, <laughs> I joined last year, so. <laughs> She's doing very well. Oh, yeah, thank you. Very good. <laughs> so in 10 years of volunteering, Jean, what sort of things would you have done at the centre over those years? Well, I started off just to, to go with the transport to, because they have to have an escort to uh, collect people from their homes and uh, bring them to the centre. And I started off and gradually it got to... Uh, I was doing, you know, other things going on trips and then doing the actual hands-on with the guests and finishing up doing discos and all sorts and and i've now got roped into friday doing desert island disc <laughs> oh, right. with, um david and lenka so uh, thank you david and lenka <laughs> so are you hosting it or are you answering no, the questions they're hosting it and i'm the person on the island i think they wish me on the island <laughs> <laughs> so if it's not a secret what would be what would be one of your songs lionel richie hello yeah. have i uh hang on a second because that's by pure flute. Is it just that song you like, or is it... I like any Lionel Richie. Would you believe that later I've been told to play, not because you're here, just by pure flute by a computer, My Destiny by Lionel Richie? Really? Wonderful. Go. Just for you, Jean. Oh, that is... <laughs> oh, you've made my day. We don't do requests, so we don't... <laughs> no. We don't do requests. Do, do, you, do you find that, Jean, when you joined 10 years ago, did you think, right, I go along as a volunteer, I'll oh, give yeah. it a couple of weeks, and we'll see how it goes. Yeah. Did, did you think you might be there... 10 years later though no I, I actually the reason i started was my mum used to go there you know um and gave her somewhere to go and and she loved it, and they were so nice to her that when somebody asked me if i could help sometimes i said oh yes you know that'd be fine thinking it would be just a few weeks but uh there you are, ten, still ten there. years <laughs> later, I'm still plodding on. In fact, I'm nearly, yeah. I'm, I'm as old as what the guests are. <laughs> <laughs> and do you find that when you go along, was it, was it two days a week, you say, that the, the, the club meets? Yes, two it days. is. Yeah. Do you find, Jean, that when you go along, you look forward to it in the same way as yes. the residents look forward I to it when they come over? I love our guests. We have brilliant people that come there don't we and they are so much fun that you know we have as much fun as they do really doing it i think sandy we'll come on to the recipe for the cake a bit later but you've brought it in in this uh, great big plastic box you brought your own knife in as well which is good and you've told us that what doesn't get eaten this afternoon we can keep for my colleagues in the newsroom that'll be gone by about five past four trust me <laughs> good. Um, cakes and foods because there's a, a bit of a food food theme on this program by, by sort of pure flute today um they play quite a big part in in what you do don't you because you they have quite do. a few coffee mornings there yeah we have coffee mornings um but we also uh have a cup of tea in the afternoon and we do provide a hot lunch um but in the afternoon it's nice to have something with our cup of tea and you know just other than the standard biscuits and quite often jean's very good at, at coming in with the cakes and things <laughs> and it, if, if she goes away on a trip she always brings back cakes for us and we do <laughs> look forward to it so it does play quite a big part yeah so you've made this cake jean yes this is you made this one yes with my own fair hands Yes. And no help from Sandy at all. N well, no. <laughs> <laughs> just just the good luck wish that it, yeah. it turned out all right yes. for today. Yeah. What about um, events coming up? What about volunteers, Sandy? Are you always looking for volunteers? Yeah. Well, we rely on volunteers to help serve the tea, join in the sessions, wash up, and pick up the lunches from our providers. Um, and we're always, always on the hunt for willing volunteers. You know, just a few hours a month. That's all it needs, really. But um, if anyone is interested in volunteering, then please do get in. OK, we'll give out the telephone number a bit later on. Um, stand by for the recipe. You always can't find a pen and a piece of paper when you want one. We'll stick up on the
the Facebook page a bit later. But in the next few minutes, uh, the recipe for the lemon curd cake. I think I do like lemon curd. I was debating, do I like lemon? I haven't had lemon curd cake for ages. If I'd known you were baking a cake... I'd have said, can you put caramel on it and, and shortbread and stuff like that? But never mind. I'm, I'm sure I like it. I eat anything really. Jean and Sandy from Mia, will you stop laughing? <laughs> <laughs> Before you ask, that's not me singing. I promise you. That's a very high note. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Again, ditto. Um, I'm going I'm to be really cruel here. When we were playing Jackie Wilson, Sandy, you were saying that you were petrified about being on the radio today, weren't you? You were absolutely petrified. I have been so nervous. I to the have, point of yeah. almost feeling, feeling ill. Feeling sick, yeah, yeah, absolutely. How do you feel I now? I, I'm feeling much better now, and I can't yeah. believe you just said that. We won't tell him anything else. No, that's it. That would teach you to try and guess my age whilst you're in. <laughs> Whilst you were coming in. Uh, Jean and Sandy, they are from the Rosemary Goddard Centre in Mir. We've heard a bit about what they do and how you can help out as a volunteer in the future. Um, if I don't do this now, I'll forget. Jean, you want to say hello to somebody, don't you? Please, could I say hello to my daughter Jane, who's in Lyon in France, and my grandson, Elias, who's three years old tomorrow. Thank you. Elliot, happy birthday. Thank you. And they're in Lyon in France, listening online. Yes, they are, on yeah. The, on the BBC Wiltshire website, yes. bbc.co.uk oh, my, forward yeah, slash my, Wiltshire. My daughter's been listening since about 12 o'clock today so that she could not miss us. <laughs> <laughs> she had a long wait then, didn't she? Yeah. Two and a half hours later. Oh, she's enjoying it, I'm sure. <laughs> Good. So our cake of the week then today, it is lemon curd cake. Yes. And you've got the recipe, Jean. Now, yes. this is up on our Facebook page already. Um, if you miss it and you can't get online, if you phone up Jerry and ask him nicely, he can pass it on. But uh, what have you got for us there? It's uh, Well, this is actually one of Delia's uh, cakes because uh, and it's very easy uh, and, and and very safe. That, is this you Delia know, Smith or one of your out. residents in no, there? No, Delia Smith. Right, okay. Let's there be any confusion. <laughs> Everybody knows Delia. I know. <laughs> right, it's a lemon curd cake, um, and you have six ounces of sifted self raising flour, a level teaspoon of baking powder, six ounces of soft margarine, three large eggs, six ounces of caster sugar. Grated rind of one lemon plus one tablespoon of lemon juice, icing sugar and lemon juice for topping, and lemon curd for the filling. And basically you grease and line two seven-inch sandwich tins, whisk electric or beat with a wooden spoon, all ingredients is together, divide between the sandwich tins, and you bake them for about 25 to 30 minutes at 170 or gas mark 3. Cool them on a wire rack, sandwich together with the lemon curd, mix icing sugar with lemon juice to make a glacé icing, add a drop of yellow colouring if liked, um, spread over cake and decorate with orange and lemon slices. And hence, that's the cake over there. <laughs> She's just pointing to it. <laughs> there you go. There it is. That doesn't work on the radio. There you are. Over there. Next, next to Sandy. Well, thank you for coming in. Just a reminder, Sen, um, if people live around the southwest Wiltshire, maybe sort of Tisbury, Warminster, Mere itself, and think, well, I wouldn't mind getting involved, either coming along or maybe being a volunteer, yeah. how do we get involved? Um, well, you can get in touch with me. Um, and we can go through the processes of, um, and I can explain to you what it takes to be a volunteer and um, what kind of commitment you're looking at, you know, whether it just be an hour a month to an hour a week even. Um, and uh, for any lonely or isolated older people out there in the district, then, you know, we are out there for you. We are a service that's there for you. So please do get in touch. And apart from making the cakes, maybe, um, what else would they be doing? Just remind us what else you do with your residents. We do, um, we do things like Tai Chi. We have singing sessions. We have art and crafts, quizzes, group games. We play Family Fortunes. That's always a, a popular one. Mm -mm. Uh, we also have um, tea dances. And this month we're actually having a disco. <laughs> so we're all going to dance around our handbags. <laughs> Um, we have day trips out about three times a year as well, as well as the usual card games and bingo and things like that. OK, is there a number we can call or a website to go to? There is my number, yeah. Mm -hmm. Would you like me to read it out? Far away. It's 07835 272 406. OK, so 07835 
272406. Have a chat with uh, Sandy from the Rosemary Goddard Centre in Mere. Uh, they've supplied our cake of the week. Thank you for coming in. Thank you. Thank, Thank you for you. being good sports. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, and for what it's worth, uh, Sandy, despite being really nervous, you were great. You were a pro. Oh, thanks. Thank you. <laughs>